What is the scrappiest or oddest thing that you've had to do to get a shot in an indie movie? Oh man, I uh, I produced and 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 starred in this film uh, called Light Cotton Twines that we shot in Ghana, Africa, in a village, like legit village. No like electricity, no running water. We were on a generator the entire time. And uh, for this scene that it was like a big wide and we had like a ton of extras in it. And they weren't really extras. They were actually just like townspeople who lived in the area. I had to go to each one of them like one by one and ask them if they would be in the background of this film. Most of them said no, but um, <laughs> we did get a few of them to stick around. And so we had to like move people, we had to like change people's outfits and then get them to move like one place or another. So then we had like a plate so we could build in and make it look like it was this massive crowd of people. It was pretty amazing. What is your favorite thing about indie film as compared to the Hollywood studio movies? I mean, I think the, the voice, like you really get to see people's true authentic POV and their voices, whether it's women, whether it's men, whether it's LBGTQ, I always mess that up, but you guys know what I mean. Um, I'm, I'm out here for you. Uh, but like, I, you know, I think the most important thing is like you just get to see like the world kind of turned on an axis and you get to see a side of it that you would never get to see or from a voice that you typically would never get to hear from. And I think that authenticity and that, again, that point of view is just so special. And that's what all of us really have at the end of the day. What is your most memorable moment from this award season, Ben? Angela Bassett the other day told me that she was Team Lawrence, that she watches Insecure and that she was Team Lawrence. And like her arms were out and they were like all like Angela Bassett arms. Like only she has arms like that. Uh, and her hair was flowing. And I was just like, oh my God, Angela, I love you so much. And you watch Insecure. I don't even know what to say right now. Is your husband here? No, Courtney's not here. Cool, 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 cool. If you want to talk some more, we can and just exchange numbers. That's weird. Okay, cool. I got it. Yep. Thank you, Miss Bassett. Okay. Um, no, but I, I was completely starstruck by Angela Bassett earlier this week. Um, it was pretty amazing, though. It's amazing to hear her say that she was a fan of the show. Um, and just my work in general. She had seen some other things that I'd done, so that was pretty amazing. You just never expect stuff like that. You never expect conversations like that. They always kind of, I saw Judd Apatow last night. Judd Apatow! And I was, he was like, oh man, you're from Insecure. And I was like, you watch Insecure, Judd Apatow? You're Judd Apatow. Like, don't you have like Judd Apatow things to do? Like stand up and shows and movies? And he's like, yeah, but I've seen the show. Like, what do you mean? You're great. And I was like, okay. Is Thank he you. a Lawrence fan as well? He didn't tell me that, but I imagine him and Leslie are both Lawrence you fans. Know. I mean, just, you know, my relationship with Judd and Els, uh, I imagine that they're probably Lawrence fans. And they better then be. uh, my final question for you is, what are you planning to do to decompress? I'm going to New Orleans. What are you going to do there? Um, I'm not really sure yet because I haven't had a chance to plan my trip uh, other than, like, buying the plane ticket to get there. Um, but I, uh, I'm going on a weekend away to just kind of get out of town and hang out and check out the Big Easy, have some long, tall, yardy drinks mixed with a bunch of alcohol that's probably going to give me a hangover the next day, but whatever. You know, you only get to live in New Orleans so many times. Anyway, you know what I'm trying to say. Uh, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm trying yeah. to say. No, you you get it. it. We got there eventually. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all the questions I have cool. for you. Thank you so much.